Ladies and gentlemen, back to a human being who does a much better intro than someone who is not here. Me, Will Neff. Hi. Welcome to Fear End. We're here with our core three, as some would say. Yeah. The and best we're talking three. about Stanley Cups, not just for hockey anymore, but for women. How do you feel, cutie? Oh, my I God. I don't know why they want them so bad. No! Oh. No! I'm fucking, I'm devastated. Yeah. Oh. Oh uh, my God. You sorry. in the group, you. Let me do it. Let me go back. You in Wait, my group. Reverse. Say the line. No, no. Stanley Cups, not just for hockey anymore, but for ladies. Cutie, how do you feel? Dude, you don't understand. Target only has a limited supply of the Valentine's ones. <laughs> Cutie, and they're you the crazy cutest bitch. pink. They're okay, so okay, okay. cute. Okay. Wait, wait, no. We have they're to be so for real. They're so cute. I we can't believe you love these Stanley Cups. We so have them. to be for real. What? I thought out of like all of the the girlies in my orbit, uh -huh. in my circle <gasps> of friends. Oh, I made you guys presents. I forgot them. That's you're dead to me. Okay. Um. Oh, I was so all, excited to give them to you too. What? I made little keycaps. I made a tiny one of Kaya and I made one of Farley for you guys. What? That's an incredibly I kind. I made gift. them and then I acrylic them and everything. And How can you be them. the same person who was saying such mean things behind the paywall? I don't like you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um. I thought out of like all the people that I know, all the girlies in my in my circle of friends, uh -huh. you would be like the first person I assumed would be the on only board reason with I have Stanley a Stanley Cup is because it came for free in in Pokemon's cookie box. I use the same Stanley <laughs> yeah. Cup. So I'm there's so a clip of me on the internet talking shit, being like, <laughs> "What's the deal with these fucking cups?" Anyway, I don't fucking <laughs> get it. And then I was like, "Oh God, I'm drinking out of." Yeah, one. I mean they hold a lot. That's they nice. keep it cold. Did you see the video though of like a car? <laughs> Watch pull it up. Yeah, yeah, a car this caught fire, news. burnt down. Well, well, I'm sorry. car no, caught him fire. being like, pull it up. I understand you're giving context, but <laughs> having to pull it up is well, car I, burnt I, down. I, I did, I did do a YouTube video on this recently. You did a YouTube video? What do you mean? Like, like I, a mogul mail on Stanley Cups? Are we considering making stream content specifically for YouTube a mogul mail no, now? It, like your, like your a, boyfriend invented a Twitch topic, streaming? Straightforward recording. Yeah, I I usually cover You did a video on Stanley Cups. I do You're more into them than me. I do videos on singular issues with the hopes of putting it on YouTube every day Ooh, for someone wants to be Charlie. <laughs> For eight hours <laughs> since 2018. Uh. Quite successfully so, I, if I do say so myself. No. Someone wants to be Charlie. <laughs> Charlie no. would never touch with a 10-foot pole 90% of the commentary. Charlie that would I, never talk about Stanley Cups. No, he would. He'd be like, oh, what's up, everybody? Stanley hey, guys, Cups I've been thinking about putting my dick in one of these, but yeah. I haven't yet. Yeah. Look at this car. It's absolutely burned oh. to shit, burned Odin's harder. Odin's beard itself could not survive the hellfire that was this vehicle. <laughs> Unlike this Stanley Cup, which remains untouched. This car is burned harder than my penis felt after a <laughs> long night at Denny's. Tutu's. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that is incredible, though. I'm confused how there's water in the cup holder, No, there's too. not just water, there's ice. Yeah, I think it's There's fake. still ice in no, the but cup In that cup holder, see that? Um, there's water. There's no audio. So did it leak? March. Oh. What, you, what audio? What context yeah, are you missing? Just in general, because I have a lot of videos you, lined up in the just future, and I want you me to... <laughs> What am I doing? I don't know. You're in between, so you keep catching it. Still, but what about the milk? It's in a fire yesterday. It still has ice in it. You want the background on Wild. this? You want the tea? Yeah. So. Her ex-boyfriend set her car on fire no, because. No, not oh. that. So that viral video, I think, is a part of the reason why Stanley Cups are so phenomenally viral on TikTok. And that is why there's they, like no, extra craze. White girls it. have had him forever. I know. Uh, well, the, the the former king of the hydration throne was Hydro Flasks. Yeah, but no, no, no. Listen, let me tell you something. You guys have met Taylor, my I little hate assistant. This fucking futon. Sorry. Oh, she is ahead of fashion trends by like nobody's business. She's had Stanley Cup for like six years. Hmm. Like, and she is she is like. She's got the white girl on fleek, and and I've seen all of her friends with Stanley Cups, and only now is the rest of the world caught on. So but this Stanley is white girl's Cup shit. Originated in like I think 1913 or something. It's a very old brand. Mm -hmm. It first started off and became an iconic thermos 
for World War II bomber pilot. That's there's like <gasps> this. My grandpa was one of those. Your grandpa probably had a stand. Oh, my cup. other grandpa's dying. Couldn't mean oh. to tell you guys. He'll be fine. Maybe he won't be fine. He'll if go he's to dying. heaven, I guess. <laughs> oh, okay. Anyway, like Mormon heaven. He's, gra- he's dying. Maybe that's he's why got I'm a grumpy. planet. <laughs> yeah. Is he gonna get a planet? He should celestial with oh. your grandmother. Well, she's alive. But when she dies, she'll go to the planet. She, they've been together for 86 years. You want to talk about her? Are you okay? No. I'm fine. Okay. So anyway. your grandfather, so he the one who already people. died, <laughs> the one who already died, yeah. I assume, the, yeah. that, that one probably had a Stanley Cup if he's a bomber That's pilot. That's awesome that he had a Stanley Cup. And Me it's and like him this both. iconic green No minor cookies for him, though. Is, is that what the Stanley Cup is named after? What? The name of the trophy that they give for the champions I don't in hockey think is so. the Stanley Cup. Oh, no, that's named out after uh, Stanley Elnats. Why do you know that? Because he's a big deal. He, his, his grandfather was cursed. He had to dig some holes. He's Stanley an icon. Stanley Elnats is a character from the book Holes. Don't correct me. Don't tell him oh, that. I don't know anything. Well, that's too damn wow. bad. You can't, was the most you can't say I don't genuine know. Genuine admission I've ever heard. Why was I you don't know anything. I don't know anything after going on a rant about the World War II bombers with these no, cups. No, I know things. I just don't know anything about like American shit. So like uh, William unless... Stanley. Oh! What? Yeah, 1913. Wait. Stanley. But what about the Stanley Cup? Who is the Stanley Cup named after? The NHL hockey. Stanley Cup. Put hockey in there in the search. Or. Stanley Yalnats. Who is going to be? Dude, they went so hard. Do you, uh, do it. Lord, Lord Stanley, Stanley of Preston. Preston. Do you want to know a crazy thing? And stay focused because we're going to come back to this. We loop around. We always come back. So holes, you know that song? Digging up uh, holes. Dig it. Two shoes, two tokens in a hand. Because no, 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 I'm the caveman. You know what I'm talking about? Absolutely no uh. idea. Anyway, it was put under Disney Records. And Disney Records doesn't know what to do with themselves because... They don't really have any other songs because they had a different label. And but then they were like, oh, we're going to have our own label. And then they had that dope ass fire beat from Holes come out. And then they were like, shit, we only have that song and one other song we don't do with it. And then they don't know what to do with it. So it's not on Spotify. It's nowhere. You can't fucking find it. And it's a banger. Wow. Upsetting. All right. What? Okay. (laughs) Dig it up a hole. Dig it. it Can I ask you a question? But Moving on from the Stanley Cup. No, he wants to go back to the bombers. But she, but she doesn't give it. She doesn't care. No, she we loop our, around. Oh, I'm anchor. gonna pretend to care. Here you go. I really thought you would be into Stanley Cups. Like I Why? literally told Will, like let's go We're to Target. So let's go to Target before get the Stanley stream Cup. and get her a Stanley Cup and like see if she would like react to it positively. That would have been so funny if you went through all that effort because I want to give a shit. Yeah, it's just not her thing. That's you guys so want nice. me to be a stereotypical like white you girl are, so bad. You are our entry point into basic white women. I only like Taylor Swift. That's the only thing basic about me. You like pumpkin spice latte. You just, latte. you just, you. On this podcast, uh-huh. you went. I'm a trad wife. I'm trying to be, but I have a full time job, and I have like two full. I've got like three okay. full time jobs. That's literally the most trad wives are the most basic white girl shit you can well, do. Well, I'm trying to get there. I'm not <laughs> there though. The wanting to be a trad wife is even more basic white girl shit. I'm tired and I'm ready to be a trad wife and make chili and turn the crock pot on. If you know what, if I didn't have to go to work today, I would have turned that crock pot on. I would have noticed. But I'd have fucking you go to like work. You like Taylor Swift, pumpkin spice latte, and wanting to be a trad wife. That's the trifecta. I don't actually want to be a trad wife. It's just a phase I'm in right now. Okay. Next month, I want to be a Why race are you car in a driver. Phase? Why are you in a trad wife phase? Let's because talk about I'm it. tired. Now that you fucking ruined our Stanley Cup segment. No, let's talk about Stanley Cups. No, no, fuck Stanley Cup. I love I them. Want... I'm so excited for the hot pink one. I waited outside at 5 a.m. Okay, let's. Hey, another thing all I can white too. women are into right now. What? Uh, hot Willy Wonka. Go ahead and pull up that Calvin Klein spread. Oh, oh yeah, Jeremy Allen actually? White. Actually? God damn. Wow. I have, I Jeremy have, Allen White, Calvin Klein. I have changed a tune. Because remember, we talked, and we said he was ugly. He is no! Ugly. Hold, hold, My hold, God. before we move on. No, let's watch it. <laughs> no, hold on. You uh-huh. said we, we me like and Austin, hell, white no, woman. No, me and him. No, I, me and I, him I, I said he was ugly hot. I'm, st- I'm still no, saying he's, he's just ugly hot. hot. He's no, hot. He's still Thank ugly you. hot. He's still Welcome ugly aboard. hot. He's still ugly Holy hot. Holy. I fought for this man. Okay, don't I get fought bad for this horny. man. Now I feel bad on for this Ludwig. podcast. No, because Ludwig and I, we were, Ludwig and I were laying on the couch yesterday, and I was like, "Have you seen the Calvin?" And he was like, "Yeah," and I was like, "Yeah." So if he was in GTA RP, would you RP? No, him? I wouldn't. Yes, you would. You fucking RP his pants. Look how big his veins are. Mine are so small. 
Oh. What? How do I get big veins? Okay, I want to say something here. What? Jeremy Allen White is still ugly hot. If he's you not. look, he's literally a butterface. He's not. No. Yes, he is. No. Pull the video up, March. March, pull the video up, please, because there's like a dick shot in there, and it's like, wow. I didn't nice. look respectfully. And then I don't look at dicks. <laughs> You know this. Okay. Uh, I've talked about so, it. So there's a dick shot and then there's a face shot that follows right after and you're like, oh no. Oh, come on. You're being mean. You're a mean girl. Okay. So oh. he's so hot. He oh. is incredibly hot. And he has the yes. Yeah, no, he looks dreamy. No, his eyes are perfect. Yeah. Wait, really? He's yeah. dreamy there. I think he still has like a I, I still think he's he looks like kind of weird. His face looks I want Ludwig to do a Calvin Klein shoot. Anyway, regardless, anyone else, my point me. was my point was that he's still ugly hot, but he is phenomenally hot. You can still be I like think he a brought nine. Back to Calvin Klein, look at that. You can be a nine out of ten and be ugly hot still. That's my point, and I think people misunderstand that. I do misunderstand that. Like people think when I say ugly hot, oh, it's like oh, you're ugly. Like no, he is really. No one has talked about a Calvin Klein spread in years until this one, and holy moly, moly. Yeah, it's incredible. He, Respectfully, he has the perfect body. He has a perfect body. I think it's not like it's not like a steroid body. I mean, I, 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 I am. His veins are so big. I want them. Correct. I want. And I want to go on the record saying I was the one saying this a while ago. I still stand by my decision. I think Jeremy Allen White is on top of the world right now. Mm. He's fucking. He's sexy as hell. I do still maintain the position that he's ugly hot. If anyone's Mm. got advice on how to get big ass veins, hit up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can. You can take vascularity supplements and you also have to do cardio and you have to lift heavy i did cardio today i played basketball yeah but do you lift no you live bra no no you fucking live bro. do you want me to get you vascular cutie if you give me two months i mean you're asking a question you're gonna make me do you're gonna make me you're gonna like yell at me you're gonna make me go uh, you're gonna make me like rum yeah yeah Yes, I'm going to I'm, do those. Things. I'm in walk club right now. We're gonna we go on a well, mile walk me, every day. What? You'll never be vascular. Moving on. I just need you're never to gonna be able to get my blood drawn. Don't even easily. ask about it. Don't even ask about it. You're always gonna have teeny little weak veins. My veins used to be big, I swear. No, and got, now they're small. You got little tiny. That's why I think maybe I'm dying. You have the veins of a leaf. But I hope I don't. I hope I don't <laughs> die. That'd be so you want bad big, on your bulbous veins. veins. You wanna see my veins? They're big. Yeah, are your veins big too? Mm-hmm. Yeah, let me see your blood sucking sleeve. vein wait, wait, wait. wearing a long sleeve shirt i'm sorry yeah, yeah i see, could get blood out of you we're vascular because we see lift. You. oh you're wearing long sleeve that's tucked in we're vascular as shit dude uh, you want to be vascular yeah come work out uh come work out i don't want out i'm gonna do a personal trainer that comes to my house by the way i've decided what we're doing what we are gonna do the disney thing but what it's going Disney to be thing? a two-day event. What? Or it's going to be a back-to-back stream. We're doing Disney versus Six Flags definitive competition. Yeah, but I don't go on roller coasters. Definitive competition. But um, I'll be there for the vibes. No, you'll go on the roller coasters. I won't. You will. Nope. Yes, it, you will. It'll be like when we did the fast food thing. I'll be there for the vibes, no, and I'll do great. But no, I, no you, you did great on the Also, Six thing. Flags doesn't allow you to take stream on a roller coaster. Oh, then you can hold it. Yeah, and I can watch you guys. But you'll come, on, you'll come on at least But one you could coaster. also Discord. You have phone. to come on one coaster. And I could watch You have to come on I, one coaster. I simply will not. You simply will. I won't. You need to start challenging Peer yourself. Peer pressure doesn't work on me. You want, it, you want to be successful? You want to be vascular? I am successful. Well, you'd be more successful. <laughs> I simply am going you the opposite. You get so being, vascular I'm on the I'm being a trad wife. I'm going the opposite direction. Actually, trad wives, I'm sure you're successful in your own way. Why are you, why are you holding the trad wife community? What do you mean holding them? Because she's basic and she saw she saw TikToks. No, I don't watch TikToks anymore. She saw Twitter. I would just be good at it. Did you where did you see the trad wife stuff? How did this get just into accept your- it? Actually, Ludwig saw the trad wife stuff and he was like he was like, I feel like you how did he phrase it? 
you should do this for me. Cook no, and clean, no. bitch. He was like, I feel like you try to do you you try to be a trad wife at the same time as working on your jobs, and it's too much for one person. And I was like, Yeah. Wait, he was literally telling you like you should probably quit your job and be my trad. No, wife. no, he was saying I do too much. That's crazy. He's he was literally saying I signaling too hard. Oh, He's signaling too... to you to stop working. That's crazy. And and bear his. No, seed. I can't. I would never. I could never. I can't even use his card to like buy shit. It gives me the heebie-jeebies. Hmm. I can't do that. I gotta make oh my, my own God, money. I would buy shit with his card all I day. I would too. That's crazy. I'd be. I don't pay. I don't pay rent right now, and it kind of eats me up. What? I don't pay rent. <laughs> it bothers me. What? What? Why would you pay rent? Cause I live at the house with him. That's so weird. What's wrong with you? Why wouldn't I pay rent? You're in a relationship. So he pays it. Yeah, he's rich. Yeah, but I want to contribute. Mm. Okay, you contribute with your love and it sounds like I contribute by chili. being trying to be a trad wife. <laughs> it doesn't fucking work. Yeah. I don't know. You could you you It's weird though. You don't you that contribute that to the relationship. You? What? That wouldn't bother you? You move a girl in tomorrow and she doesn't help pay for anything? No. Would that bother you? Do you and Caroline split rent? What? Do you cover it? What? What's wrong with you, dude? I've never. I have, I, dude. What is happening today? Am I losing my mind? It, like, here's the thing. Here's the we thing. We just recorded it, the bonus episode before this episode, by the way, and we were talking about like relationship RP, and they go check out the episode after this because they have a crazy take. Patreon.com slash for your end. But <laughs> we dude, have a crazy take. I love that you, you, dude, you. The girlies will. Re girlies, hi. Um, type one in chat if you agree, because they just will. Okay, to what? be fair, I think you already lost the girlies because you're not a Stanley Cup Does it scare you that the girlies girl. like us more than you? They don't. <laughs> they 100% do. Besides Caroline. Maybe they do. I don't know. Girl, because some of them maybe have crushes on you, and I don't blame them because not me. They, might, they might have crushes on you guys, and so they like you, and I don't blame them for wanting to have crushes on you guys, but girlies, stand with me, okay? That's crazy. That's so desperate for you doing that. It is, but I I've lived with many a boyfriend. No, okay, that if, sounds like I'm an issue. Listen, I, I've you, never not split. If you're rent the ever, rich ever, one, ever. if you're the rich partner in uh -huh. the relationship, he's and not like, that much richer than me. Come on, cutie, cutie, cutie. Guys, do you not want to hang out with me because I'm broke? Be honest. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Cutie. I'm so broke compared to no, all my friends. It blows my mind. You know what's going to happen? Huh. I'm going to go, no, cutie, we want to hang out. And then you go, I hate you. <laughs> yeah, we've been burned before. But anyway, listen, uh -huh. uh, let's say you're in a relationship with not Ludwig, but instead a uh, broke boy. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. it, it would be valid for you to pay for the rent, too, mm. if you already had a place and, oh. and you're your boyfriend moved in with you i guess i've always just been in relationships where we've been pretty equal pay wise and so we just split everything split okay and that's fine but and so yeah. i feel weird not but i don't think you were ever like in a relationship with someone as rich as ludwig no that there no. it is <laughs> no you have your answer dude but yeah if I was in a relationship with Ludwig, I'd be fucking taking his credit card. Yeah, I'd be pound I town. I think you're just as rich as Ludwig. that plastic. No, I'm not as rich Cutie. as Ludwig. This is drama. Cutie. What? Ludwig's got them YouTube dollars. Yeah, that's crazy. Really? You yes. know his contract. What yeah, but he has so many employees. You've got your your expenses are so different. Fair. He's but got like 80 employees. But he's not paying all of his employees for his YouTube contract. With he's got to pay him somehow. Not paying him through his YouTube. How contract. is he paying him? Through the rev through other revenue. Streams? He made they, his his his. I. They make money off of like why is he selling merch? Good point. You're on. And something. and also selling <laughs> tickets to live events and also slutting all of his friends Dude, out. Maybe he's rich. Yeah. I've never really thought about it. Yeah, he's disgustingly rich. He should buy me things. He owns yeah. like a fucking. He owns like a media company. And also many. Hey, I'm standing my ground. He should buy me more stuff. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What should I get? Oh, you should get some fucking Alexander McQueen handbag. I don't shit. want that. Birkin. I'd lose it. Get the Birkin. Get I the Birkin. I don't want it. You'd lose a bag? I've lost my Prada bag and get my Chanel bag that he got Birkin. me. Birkin. Get. I lost it. Uh, Birkin. What about good luggage? No, I don't want it. 
I don't travel. Oh yeah, that's right. She's weird. I don't think I want anything. Um, <laughs> you're not like me. <laughs> be honest. <laughs> What else did you have to talk about today besides Stanley Cup? I have a bunch of stuff, okay, but I'm, I, I'm way more interested in your your. I insanity. feel like Will is mad at me today. Why? Are you mad at me? No. <laughs> Don't even okay. think about it. Um, here, I, let me pull this up. Let me pull this up. I got some stuff. You wanted to talk about January sixth. Okay. Um, can you pull up Don't. the? No, of course not. Can you pull up the Boeing plane that was? A uh, freaking thing fell off of it. What? No. No, there's what? a... What? There's a Japanese one that burned? Shit, maybe we shouldn't look at this. You guys want me to get on these planes? Wait, maybe we shouldn't look at this. With the, I, I was going to do it because, like, Austin's no, not I, here. No, this is good, though, because this one yeah. had the door fly off yeah, in Yeah, Boeing air. plane. Yeah, Everybody but lived. no one was in that seat. Everybody Boeing plane. Even if they were That's in that seat, That's why I don't sit in window seats, because actually there was another time that a chunk of, like, the door flew off, and this lady got sucked out, and then these people grabbed her by her legs to save her, but she already died. Bitch should have had her seatbelt on. She did. Nah, the whole last chair went out. What? That's, that's crazy. Wait, yeah, there's another instance before. of a pilot flying out the front, and they yeah, held his legs he and he survived. lived. Why are they? Why are people flying out? You know where I don't fly out? Right here. There's no. There's well, a zero percent chance I fly out of this room unless cutie, you throw me. Don't. I do gotta it. be honest. You should start traveling because those super small veins are clear indication you don't have long. So you really? To, yeah, you need to make the most. You're making out of that life. up. No. I went to the doctor this week because I thought I had now cancer. Now she's gonna freak out. So and, now even if something goes wrong, they can't tell your veins are too tiny. I know. That's what I'm starting to think. You know what actually grows your veins? Light. Yeah. They don't. Yeah. No, they do. Pressure Look, change. Hold it up, March. Hold that shit up. Wait. So why did a different plane? I'm kidding. Just play the video. Why dude. did a different <laughs> plane catch on fire? <laughs> Uh, he's literally pulling. He's a googling. Car drove dude, into dude, fucking tarmac. airplanes. A car drove into a plane on yeah, a tarmac. Yeah, because cars aren't safe. Well, why did they do that? Because, because they were they... cleaning up after the earthquake. Wait, actually. Yes. Wait, are you talking about Japan? I'm talking about Japan. Was it? Was Everything it I just told you was factual. Yeah. Even though it caught on fire. Yes, because yeah. planes are. Did you know? Safe. The, hey, do you want to hear something crazy that I know? What? There was this plane. In London, the biggest plane accident ever. No one talks about it. It was really foggy at the London airport, and uh, one it's plane. Heathrow. They were yeah. One plane was taking off, and one plane was landing, and they crashed, and they both died. Everybody <laughs> on all the planes. They both died. Both of the planes died, and the everybody on them. There was six hundred people freaking died. It's when crazy. was it? Like in fucking nineteen forty-three. No, it was like a few years ago. I don't believe that. I don't know. Marsh, can you look that up? It, London. But yeah, he'll Wait, I want to see the 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 door, the door flying. Yeah, oh, it's crazy, and I wanted to start off with that video, but we've been flying all over the place. People liked that. Yes. Yes. Bro, this is fucked up. No, it's actually kind of dope that it's like yeah, everybody, everybody survives lives. and then everybody lives. And I bet those people get a bunch of free miles. That lady's me. I'm like, what the fuck? No, that lady's not you because you don't fly. She does. She's brave. Well, there's a reason. She's brave. Now you're a coward. Now they have trauma they have to talk to their therapist about. I already can't afford my therapist. Feeling. Get lower. And then paper. I look to my left, and there's this huge chunk, part of the airplane, just like missing, and the wind is just extremely loud. There's wind blowing everywhere. Just let it play. Why did a chunk just blow off that's not even the emergency door? I don't get it. Okay, so there was no one seated on it. There was thankfully no Chunks shouldn't be flying off. That's true. And uh, I heard the, a pop noise. I thought the wind come forward and then it came back. It hit me in the face. Who is guy? He's trying so to make cool sense looking. of what's going on. I wasn't afraid. I don't know why, but you know. And yeah, you're like that. Not me. No one yeah, knows. you're like that. That's actually not me. She's not me yeah, for real. She, unlike you, is not a coward. Dude, I would be so sad if I was on that plane. I'd be so stressed. But, but then you would probably. Turns out my uncle though is starting to fly to Hawaii, so maybe we could go to Hawaii. But I don't want to go to Hawaii because if a place was gonna get bombed, it would be Hawaii. It's so close to everything, and you're like trapped. You like can't leave, guys.
No one agrees with me, right, ladies? <laughs> <laughs> ladies, you're standing with me this episode, remember? Even if you have crushes on them, forget them today. Today is our day. Kitty, That's I don't like the insi- insinuation that we only- promote these paramo- parasocial relationships. They might. I, I like now, that. I like that you think uh, women can only agree with us because they are sexually attracted. Yeah, yeah. We've never done anything like that. You guys yeah. are stupid, ladies. <laughs> no. We love you. No. Why don't you sound off in the? <sighs> oh my That's God, right. I don't even. It would make me really happy. It'd make Ew. us so happy. They're not falling for Kitty, it. Kitty, we don't. We don't. <laughs> Look at that plane on fire! And everybody lived. Yeah, everybody survived. So, dude. It's not okay that that's everybody on fire. survived. How's it exploded? Like, even the guy in the oh, car. Kaya. Oh, Kaya. I shot the guy in the car. Survived. Let's see how she does here. I was adjusting the cameras. My yep. queen. No, no she's not. Killed right. it. She actually didn't. Dude, I am pulling. Why is no one pulling the emergency door right that second? Because. Oh my God! How did they get off in time? Bro, huh? Hey. This video should prove that you sh- you can come to Japan and feel safe. Yes. I'm drunk in the back of the car, and I cried like a baby coming home from the bar. <sighs> you guys need to learn the whoa. Dude. Yep. But all of their clothes caught on fire, huh? Nope. No. Their luggage. The only thing that happened is... The- I would not give a flying the two pets. fuck about my luggage <gasps> if I survived. Uh- there were two pets in the cargo containment. Container that passed away. God damn it, us. They didn't evacuate the pets. God damn it. You're not bringing Swift. That's so tragic. Yeah. Well, she, wasn't she the one who wanted to euthanize all the otters anyway? No. They yeah. euthanized them, not no, me. That was yeah, you. yeah, that was you. No, they do that it. was 100%. You, you are a big advocate for otter euthanization. Yeah, you fought no. for it. What? The place you went. You guys are the one that paid them money. Yeah, they don't yeah, euthanize otters. So they otters. survive. They do. Mm. No. We paid them money so they live and they thrive. They thrive. They don't. They you did treats. not pay them money because you want them to be euthanized. Bingo. That's opposite, actually. That's that's crazy. Yeah. I don't put business. I don't give money. Or money. I don't give. Right, and that lack of business causes other otter cafes yeah. to have to unfortunately shut down. Good. No otters shouldn't no. be with because humans in cafes. Otters should be in the wild. Says you who've never in the wild. Says you who've never been with an otter. Yeah, Actually? honestly, if you went to an otter cafe, your world would change. Yeah, the it otter wouldn't. Would rock I would, your world. I, yeah, I'd be more depressed because I'd be like, "Wow, I can't believe they're gonna euthanize all these otters." And no, they don't. They don't weeks. euthanize them. This yes, was they a, do. This was a la- no was, euthanization that otter. That's news. not true. They're it all is so true. No, Mar, I can't believe you saw my YouTube and you clicked not on my YouTube. He did choose, his but songs. you chose Guys, Will next that, YouTube. Or you cho- <laughs> it's a. My that's YouTube is not followed enough, though. That's good. That's crazy. Yeah. All those otters are dead now. No, they're thriving. Oh, look at the little hands. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They give you a little See high the joy? Five. Yeah, the joy from Austin, who's a known murderer. A known oh, murderer? Look at that one. Look at that one. Yeah. Look at that one. Now that he's not here, I think it's time we talk about it. Dude, otters should not be living in a, a four by four box. Jake, I, I desperately don't. have never been alive. I desperately want a pet otter now. No, you're bad. bad. They smell so bad. No, they were cute. My cat kind of looks like an otter. Yeah, let's just go back to Japan. Yeah, I can't wait. Have fun. You're coming. No. Oh my god, cutie. <coughs> I thought by this time you were going to be fixed. Yeah. What happened? I don't think Are I'll you ever even get working fixed. on yourself, cutie? I go to therapy twice a week. It's so expensive. You just raise the price, too, and I'm like, shit. Damn, you're so fucked up. Your doctor was like, we got Damn, she I know. bumped the she rate. She keeps raising the price. She raises it like every three months. That's Your brutal. doctor literally Yeah, it's like, so much I money, can't. too. Because your doctor's like, I got to pay for therapy. Yeah. I know. I think I'm going to have to start going once a week because it's too much money. It's yeah. Get Ludwig to pay for it. I'm True. not going to do that. Yeah. I literally pay her like a salary. Oh. Get wow. Ludwig what? to pay for I, your it's therapy. It's 325 a session. What? Yeah. Ooh. Is that a lot? I don't know. For therapy. 600 a week? That's yeah, that's a lot of money in general, but is that a lot for therapy? Oh, you don't have insurance. No, I do have insurance now, but it, it she doesn't cover? take insurance, I guess. That's I don't know. What? 
Yeah, I don't, I don't get it. A lot of fuck, cashish. What the fuck I kind know. of weird it's ass way therapist too expensive. is this shit? It's a trauma EMDR therapist. Yo, that fucking price is traumatic. Yes. No, I should be so Scra- skilled. Straight up, straight up. Go huh? to a new therapist. I'll do the therapy half the price. <laughs> okay, I'm in. But my methods. Yeah, my veins are gonna get bigger. Hopefully, my, my methods are considered unusual. By we many. will be drugging you and putting you on a plane. Exposure therapy. I'm just gonna turn you into a CrossFit chick. That's gonna be my therapy. I don't want to be a CrossFit chick. Well, no one wants to get better, <laughs> cutie. You got to do. I the do. Work. I want to get better. Yeah. So you're gonna. We're gonna I first to work on your biceps, sticker. and they're gonna become a shield for your soul. I'm drunk in the back of the car, and I cry like a baby coming home from the bar. Woo woo. Close. I tried. I don't know what you want from me. Okay. Um, we're done talking about planes being on fire. I'm I happy have that another, didn't extend I have a very hero long. that I want to talk about. Oh, wow. Ooh. Truth Teller Eagle. Fuck. The hero of Truth Teller Eagle. What is that? It's a web. It's his website. Website. It's a fan made website for me. Um, Why does he have that? Please look up Bass Pro Shop Cannonball. Oh, we should have done this fucking behind the paywall. Yeah, because Why? we can't watch the video. Because he's got a micro penis. I mean, I guess we Who? can still look at it and then yeah, like we can look at it and censor Who it. Who has a micro penis? Uh, the 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 absolute hero legend. I I mean, we can look at the video if you want, yeah. but but it's not going to show you the. It's on Twitter for sure. What do you? Who, a man. You, to be honest, I don't even think we'd get demonetized for showing it because his he, his penis is so small you can't see it. You can't see it. You're not giving enough context to me and the viewers. All right. There is a man in uh, the Bass Pro Shop that was arrested. He's 42 yes. years old. Okay. He was arrested for nakedly cannonballing into the aquarium at a Bass Pro <gasps> Shop, and there's video footage of it. Mm. And he swims in there for a little bit before the cops arrive, and he has. The tiniest penis of all Why time. Why did he do this? Did they say? He's a fucking legend. Yeah. But like a real reason. Was he like on drugs or um, lonely? I think he's, or? he's a legend. Heroes live forever, but trying to make a legends moment. never die. Okay. No, cool. <laughs> that cleared things up. Yeah. Actually. You're welcome. Are there bass in their aquarium? Yes. What else is in there? All oh. kinds of fish. By the way, I, I can offer you a, a little olive branch here. We're going to do another fear end trip. What? To Memphis, yeah, uh-huh. to the Memphis uh, Bass Pro Shop Pyramid, Pyramid. which is like uh-huh. an amusement park bass shop. Uh huh. And we're gonna stay there. Can you drive to Memphis? When are you trying to go to Memphis? Probably within the next two or three months. Hmm. Right as the, how long is that flight? Right as the streamer awards. Is how long is the flight? Like two hours. Uh, will you Google it, Mark? Wait, you would do a two-hour flight? The flight from LAX to Tennessee. Well, because I wanted because Taylor Swift. Uh, uh, she kind of like grew up in Tennessee, so I thought maybe it'd be. I've always wanted to go to Tennessee, but three thirty-five. Uh. Cutie, uh, that's not that long. Cutie, that's not that long. cutie, cutie. I would give you half my winnings from Austin. That would pay for like ten minutes of your therapy. What'd you win from Austin? Ten thousand dollars. You'd have to pay us. 10, How did you win ten thousand dollars? Cutie, the bet. What bet? If so you long. get oh. on a plane, wow, it's been so long. <laughs> if you get on a plane before uh-huh. he gets an apartment and in Los Angeles, well, I win ten racks. I'm trying to go. I'm trying to go to. I want to go to Paris this year is a goal because Taylor Swift has a show in May, and so I thought that was a good goal. And I want to work my way up to it by doing a smaller flight. But Memphis, three hours seems a little long. Paris is fifteen hours I away. I know, but I've never done it. That's why Me- I have to three work hours my way is up. up and down, dude. It's so quick. You would, yeah, you wouldn't even know you're on a plane. I, listen, I would charter a private jet. Mm-mm, no, that's worse. I okay, don't want that. we would get first class. No, it has to be, uh, it has to be a Airbus. Yeah, or the Dreamliner. It All right, no I would, work. I would, I would schedule flyer. this flight. And Austin has to be on the plane. Well, actually, I'm scared to be on the plane with Austin because I feel like it, like. For some reason, Austin and I have this idea that if we're both on the same plane, something bad will happen. He'll be on a different flight, though. Yeah, but it's also a nice idea if Austin's on the plane because if something did happen, maybe he could fly it. Whatever you need. I don't know what I want. Whatever you need. Will you go to? to will you go to? Uh, will you go to a? Um, 
a fortune teller beforehand and see what they say about your lifespan. And if they say you'll live a long time, because I'm too afraid to go to fortune teller, you can go and they'll say if you live a long time, then we can get on a plane together. I'll do all of that. <laughs> okay. But you have to commit to go within the next three months. I'm, I can't commit because it really stresses me out. But I, I'm okay. I will actually you think about this. You won't this commit. One. You won't commit. But I'm actually thinking about it. But I will it. buy an extra ticket. No, no, no. Cutie, this is a trip for the. I have to the... pick out the plane. What I've if Taylor Swift the was plane. there? Cutie, how are you not going to commit but still pick out the plane? I've got to pick out the plane. Okay, so you're committing. But it has to be Delta. But I'm yes. thinking about it. Okay. Why does it have to be Delta? But this is I a... only fly on Delta Cutie, or JetBlue. This is a podcast trip. It would be unbelievable I'm just, like, content. I'm thinking about it. It would be unbelievable why would it, content. Why, would I, why does it have to be Delta or JetBlue? Because they have the least access. Because those are the only ones I fly on. Why are those the only ones you fly on? Because my mom used to work for JetBlue, so I feel like she's like watching over those planes, and then Delta's just the goat. We could also fly JetBlue Mint to Memphis, I which do is like sick. JetBlue. Have you ever flown Mint? Yeah. It's so nice. You can lay flat. I know. Ah, such a long flight. Nope, it's one of the shorter flights you can impossibly take in the world, actually. Yeah, what do you, like, Vegas is the only flight that you'd be down to take, mm. I guess, then. No, because Vegas is too short. It's... What? Cutie. Uh... All right, I'm committing Cutie. I'm thinking about I'm it. I'm committing Cutie to it. Now let's watch this video. Cutie's going to Memphis. Are we going to see his penis? Yeah. Yep. This is crazy. The You'll juxtaposition be between it. this and <laughs> Jeremy Allen White or whatever. Look at him go. Look at the little guy. Yeah, show us the dive. He's swimming around. Oh. Oh, it's it's blurred. No, nah, it's blurred. That's fine. That's blurred. So you don't have to blur it. Well, that one's more. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. He stood up, and then he's like, one more time. <laughs> yeah. What an interesting thing to do. Sick. What is he saying? My fucking right. Why is it his right? One more. Oh my god, his hoo ha is out. Yeah, and it's so tiny. Oh my god, yeah. he just went like this. Yeah, he's doing jerking off hand motions. Oh my god, he's. I think he's like a. Is he like a voyeur? Do you think he wants to? I think he's a flasher, yeah. I like how he keeps going. Woo! Oh! Wait, that was. Did he just jump out? Yeah. I didn't see that part. Wait, wait, wait. My man funny. bounced. Oh! I think he was trying to escape. <laughs> he's definitely broke his ribs. What the fuck? Oh. Why did he think he could get away like that? He's gonna be so slippery. Or they they can't they tase him. They do not need to point oh anything god, at him. Oh my god, bro! He's not you cannot right. tase yeah. him, dog. He's wet as hell. He's gonna die. Dude, this poor police officer is right yeah, in I his butt. He did not have much fight in him after that. Yeah. Now what are you gonna do with him? Well, he's wet. He ought to be able to slide across this door pretty good. <laughs> A better be able to slide across this floor pretty good. It does not really matter at this point. That's so sick. Oh my god. I'm gonna oh, sit. oh, he's slithering. Oh my god. They're, they're oh. just dragging him. Well, well his dick's too. not gonna touch That's the ground, so it's not a problem, you know. I grab the hair. Oh. My God! You need to see the penis, though, Kitty. I don't know if I I'm want gonna to. send March both two different videos. One is gonna be the video I want to watch next, oh. and the one before that is gonna be the penis video. You have, hey, I respect your, I respect your grind this week. Right. You have a lot you want to talk about. Yes. I was here to, I have vibes. That's what I brought this week. Yeah. Really bad vibes. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what <laughs> the? <laughs> I disagree. I don't. I disagree. I'm not even second, phased anymore. The second video, yeah. So I had this exact same take that Felix did, which is kind of funny. Holy shit! But That's so I, much I said blood. the exact same thing. I was like, it's so brave of like a grower, not a shower, in a cold environment like this, to basically put himself out there. 
But like he's it not like he's not like he's not like a grower. He has like a a, a, a he pussy. Yeah, it looks like a like vagina. I, I physically here, pull it up. Big screen. Oh. I can't find Yeah, I can't yeah, find I can't see a penis. He has a micro penis. Yeah, he has a micro penis. But yeah. What do you think about that? Uh, I think less about that than Jeremy Allen White, if I'm being honest with you. Is that his name? Jeremy Allen White? Yeah. I still think he's... It's cool to go by ugly, three names. Ugly hot. Edgar Allan Poe, Jeremy Allen... Oh, wait. Both Allen. They're related. Yeah. That's huge. Everybody knows when your middle name is Allen, you're related to all the other people with middle names Allen. Um, wow. Will's scream is so loud. I couldn't think straight. Um, okay. <laughs> I'm waiting for Will to show this next one because... Well, give me a tee up. A tee up is... I mean, it's just a weird video. I wanted to hear you. How did you, you find it? it. Find what have you been doing this week? You've just been on the internet? You've just, just been crazy? weird videos. You sound, it feels like I'm talking to my high school kid. That's all you're giving me? Your high school kid? Yeah. What oh, mean? hey, what'd you do this week? I just found weird videos. I do. I find weird videos. He likes oh weird videos. God, I'm going <laughs> to. All right. What else did you have for us? Ooh, what's this? This is Ooh. cannibals and the Agori, uh, the Agori cannibal sect. Oh my god! I kind of want to watch the full vid now. Like I found this and I was like, this seems. I right, play it. Let's awesome. see what happens. Oh my god! Is what is those? Teeth. Uh, human. Maybe. Maybe I I'll take this off right now and then. Okay. Just thank you. Uh, okay. Thank you. I don't think this is Why a good idea. Why are people on that side of the river so afraid of the Agori? I see. Um, why, why do... I see. Um, why, why do... I think he should leave. Like, this may have been a mistake. Maybe we just, like, somebody distracts him and then I just leave. Let's see where it goes. I can be polite. I can be very polite about it. The director saying, let's see where it goes is fucked. I think it might be fake. Oh. I, I feel like it's... That was then so Then Nathan good. For You pops out. <laughs> that was so good. Him just say if you talk so much, I'm gonna cut your head I wanna off. I want to see the I want to see the OG version of this, like the full version of this. That's interesting. Cannibals. I would be freaked out by that. Yeah, yeah, but I feel like you, he's you could frail, take that guy. Though. He tries he, to cut your head off. You, how's he gonna cut your head off? I don't frail know. I'm fuck. gonna be honest. Crazy Trump's all. Really? Yeah. Anytime you're fighting, there's a certain level of crazy that you just can't deal with. There was a. <laughs> There's just things that you're not willing to do, right? He's willing to bite, scratch, stab. You're not willing to do that if it's life or death. I I don't. Biting think... is not going to be your first tool in your arsenal. He yeah. he is. He's going to go in head first with the bite. Right. Yeah. You punch that guy in the mouth. He's biting your fucking knuckles. Yeah, he's going to bite and scratch and. And mouth bacteria is very dangerous, so yeah, you'll get messed up. It you is. Win that fight. Yeah. Um. Mike, the situation on Jersey Shore, he got in a fight with Ronnie one time. Yes. And so he went to slam his head through the wall because he said one time he got in a fight with a guy that was much bigger than him and he slammed his head through the drywall and then the guy didn't want to fight him because he looked so crazy. But then they were in Italy and he tried to slam his head through the drywall, but it was actually a cement wall and then he passed out. Oh, really? So sometimes crazy doesn't work. <laughs> That's pretty funny. <laughs> yeah. Are you watching the Jersey Shore? Like, are you rewatching it or something? No, I just remember that. That is a memorable moment. That's it. That's all the videos I have. I'm you said, right oh, 
My God, you were not. Oh my God. I'm still. You're not allowed to sit here and tell me, oh, boy, I have all these weird videos. And I said, what did you do this week? And he said, watched weird videos. And that's all you give me. And then you say you're out of videos after your first weird video. I've I brought there up like two. four. I brought up like four <laughs> topics today for us. That's to fine. I appreciate that, but it's. But just... that was the one v weird video I wanted to see if we could find the full one. Thank you, Hassan. Thank you, Hassan. What kind of weird videos do you have for us, cutie? Oh, that's right. You have none. Yeah, don't pull your phone out. Oh, <laughs> you don't think? You don't think? I don't. <laughs> that I put effort into this? No, I don't think. Mm -hmm. No. One second. I got a citizen app thing. That has if it me was wine about it, a she'd little have stress. eight segments. Yeah, she'd be like, oh. Oh, what's it, up? I actually, we what's actually up, don't guys? need segments because we're just electric. Yeah, what's up, and guys? So we My just, name is we just Cutie vibe. Cinderella, and this is wine about it. Today, we're going to talk about how men ain't shit, just like last week's episode. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we do talk about how men ain't shit every yeah. single time and how people shouldn't GTA RP relationships. And it's awesome. No, I do have notes saved, though. Um, I Nominations for Stream Rewards start Monday. Wow. Can you believe that? I did my part. I nominated for the game or the games that you, segments that you were putting out there. You chose, you helped, you voted for categories is what you did. Yeah, I did that. That's good. You're Love welcome. Love that. Thank On you. Stream. Um, you did that. Oh. I thought all the categories from last year except for Valorant. What? No. Uh, every year there's new categories that get voted in. Yeah, I know. I was saying that all the categories last year were good except for Valorant. Oh, <laughs> why, yeah, yeah. why no Valorant? Valorant they was were, bad. Because they were mean I took it to away Kai from Day. them. Oh. You didn't know that? Oh, yeah. I said, you guys can't, you guys can't have it. Oh, no. <gasps> I had this TikTok saved with this drama, and the bitch deleted it. <laughs> what was the drama? Oh. Frick. Walk us through the drama. It was this girl that made out with everyone at her company party. She made out with, and then she got fired. And she's like, "Why aren't the men getting fired?" And I wanted you guys to take on it. Did the men make out with everybody? She made out with the men. There's zero percent chance that like she, if she's the one who made out with every single person, Fuck. I feel like <laughs> she might have been a little bit more belligerent than everybody else. <laughs> You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, but don't you think like that it, it reverse like, the roles, Hassan? Wait, like, wait, I wait. feel like I found it. If a dude was making out with everyone at the company party, like I don't think the women would be fired in that situation. I think the dude making out with everybody would be fired um, as well. Shouldn't be fired for making out though. Well, that's, that's why, just a good Christmas well, party. That's why I think it's more than that. Is what I'm saying because yeah. there's no way it was just like she was just even the logistics of like trying oh, to make out. but before we move on that while we were talking about stream rewards real quick yeah. i'm doing a new award this year and it might be controversial bald a streamer no why would i do that it is is it an award for women yeah and minority genders is combined i got it from valorant's game changers okay minority genders what do you mean like, like non-binary okay because the because the platform because the top... So it's women and non-binary? Is that mm -hmm. what it is? Yeah, because the top 100 streamers, 98 of them are male. And so I thought it would be a fun Let's category to try to highlight women Let's and non-binary. Let's go, men. Let's yeah. go. Talk but I'm you, nervous that people are going to be mad. Oh, what? Nothing. You don't need to be highlighted. Yeah, haven't you learned your lesson? You know what? I think you could offset it if you mm -hmm. just had, like, burliest bastard. No, yeah. I don't need to offset it. The 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 platform like offsets it with the Off, ninety eight percent. Offset it. Offset it with fattest nuts. No, <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to do that. Cause then it'd be fun. It'd be like game changers, ladies no. and non binary and trans and media. And then next up, fattest nuts. fattest nuts. That's yeah. a category I might win. It's not a bad idea, but I I'm not gonna do it. Yeah, no, I'm it not in. doing thick thickest ropes. ropes. I would a hold thick it in. Do both. Do I'm fat nuts and it. thick ropes. I would hold it in for like a month. Just Ew, so I, I don't that. want. 
Ladies in the chat, you've got to be with me now. Yeah, I'm going to be honest. Those would be your highest rated awards. Yeah. Fattest nuts and thickest robes. No, a, I'm not doing a, it. I, I thought thick robe and fat nuts was the same. Was, was, I, was I wrong? No, because fat nuts is like your actual sack. Oh, thickest you meant robes like are your, your ball sack. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fair, fair. I thought oh, you meant he nut. Oh, he thought you meant fat nut. Like, no, you nut. no, that's thick robes. Yeah, yeah that's thick, thick robes. robes. You're right. And it's good to clarify these things because it would get confusing to a voter. <laughs> yeah. Dude, ah, come on, cutie. No. We're Do you not never kidding. give anything to us. We'll never travel. We'll never have the you fat nuts. You can travel without me, and Emily will take my spot. She already said she would. True. Like in the pod. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. She would say she'd fill me in. Yeah, true. She would oh, sit in for, for me. Good? When I, sure, if you want her to. <laughs> but whenever you travel, yeah, she don't would, even she'd test fill that, in. bro. She's gonna fucking take it. <laughs> Emily, Emily would. She's Emily like, would oh, and I thank, would. She's like, thank God, I'm done with the pod. Um. She won't even do the fat nuts. Guys, award. question. No, what? can I be serious for a second? What? Don't move on. I think your award is nice, and I think it's it's meaningful, and I think the people that appreciate it are the people that you care about anyway. So, f women and non-binary. No, <laughs> yeah, I, women I and non-binary. No, <coughs> I appreciate the award. Hassan appreciates the award. No. I think it's important. Oh. I don't appreciate it. Oh, okay. I think, uh, I think it's well, bullshit. at Why first not I was gonna call it the Radiance Award because I, I kind of liked it. I liked it. I liked it being abstract. Why not men? But then I decided that was too f like feminine. Sure. And Ludwig had a good point. He was like, "You should call it the Against All Odds Award because, like, you know, oh, you know." But that felt like a mouthful. And so then he was like, "What about the Defiance Award?" And I was like, "That sounds bitchy." And uh, I think Against All Odds is good though. But this is what I landed on. Are you ready for it? Tell me if you're inspired. <laughs> the the pussy award. <laughs> so it's going to be the game her award. Oh, no, just kidding. Just kidding. I just like kidding. that. No, no. Because no, non-binary. Non-binary. Non oh. It is. Game her plus. Non-binary. Game, game her plus award. The Sapphire Award. Recognizes. Damn, a you should work for Oprah. Uh, recognizes a streamer who, like a sapphire, is formed against all odds. This is a streamer who has excelled in entertaining at the highest level in the past year despite facing significant challenges in the industry where 98 percent of the top streamers are male this award is dedicated to streamers who identify as female or minority gender who flourish in the face of adversity what does minority gender mean non-binary why don't you just say non-binary because um it gets really complicated i found out so i have a cousin who's non-binary and uh they said <gasps> they said that they are not I feel like I can't speak on it based on Twitter because I'm not a part of it. Sure. But they said they are not queer. And okay, so some people were saying instead of saying non-binary, I should say queer. But then some people said instead of saying queer, I should say non-binary. And it just got really complicated and messy. And so I just took minority gender from uh, Game Changers because also trans people at times sure. might still do like you could still identify. You could be you could be a trans female who still you could still use he she or them pronouns and technically you could st you're st still a minority gender because it's really complicated All right. i'm with it i'm this too cis female you know, you, you know to you speak on it to, but this I, was a lot of fun having you yeah having you articulate to explain it. it i really did i've <laughs> talked to a lot of people i talked to my 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 stepbrother who's trans i talked to my cousin who's non-binary i talk to twitter I, I do actually i have a lot of uh, Judy, it's a well thought out idea i, I, I yeah. like the name and i do think you should you give a it. real sapphire to people though i don't it. have that kind of money you should just figure it out oh wow you don't have that kind of money for minority genders well you're wasting oh, all your money no. on therapy he sounds like twitter <laughs> Yeah. I am wasting my money on therapy. I don't think it's helping, and so, I've spent so you, much money. You, I don't know okay, what to do. Well, you do need to get ready. People are going to yell at you. It doesn't matter. You why? have to block it out. Kitty. What do you mean, why? Because everyone you know is a why. fucking loser. Just because you want to highlight other people doesn't Here, mean you want to diminish do you other do you people. you role play? Yeah. What the hell is a minority gender anyway? I want to say it's people that... Is that are, just a black woman? <laughs> no. I don't understand why we can't just say this is an award for black women. Um, because and then, and then there's the other side. Being black isn't a um, race. It's, actually, this is kinda, is, it's, it is a race. It's not a gender. Actually, it's kind of messed up that you didn't uh, spe specify xenogender, which is underrepresented as a category. Yeah, really what about them xenos?
Xeno gender. I would say that's a minority gender. Yeah. Well, it seems like you didn't select any Xeno gender people specifically on that basis. Uh, I came for the fat nuts award. Also, Where is it? That's also, a platform as, issue. That's not also, a me as issue. As far as overcoming great odds, don't you think um, disabilities are are great odds that people overcome? Why are and there no Sapphire people specifically disabled? And Sapphire is already the name of a book about a disenfranchised black because woman dealing with her weight is about, in the face of adversity. It got turned went, into a movie this is about, called Precious. <laughs> this is about gender. Guy, you went this from being, <laughs> being a fucking reactionary Wait. to being woke. No, no, no. He's, he's reactionary. So he just loves he just loves sa- he just loves he Pushed loves by Sapphire. Women. He loves the movie Precious. I do, that movie touched me. I do. My think. mother dealt with weight problems. I do think that there will be people being like, why isn't there, you know, why isn't there a an award for other kinds for of disability or race men. or or just minority genders or men. Or, no, there is the platform. No, people will ask for the men thing. Yeah, what but the hell is so wrong funny. With you? I know they will. Where's ask that. the award for man? I thought I thought we If I get too much now. hate, I'll honestly get rid of it next year. No, but oh my god, I'm trying to just oh keep god. killing themselves well, in droves. I'm gonna try not to, but no, we'll you, see. You're the reason the suicides rates up. It's important to me <laughs> oh to god. highlight minority genders in a space that isn't like whatever, but the point I still is- don't know what that is, and I'm too <laughs> angry to read. Okay. I did get some retort the first year. I, I don't think I've ever talked about this vocally. <laughs> Talked about this vocally. That was as opposed as to talking about a qu- Yeah, it was dumb <laughs> without, as hell. I don't know why they came out of my mouth. Without using um, vocals. I got some. There was some uh, pe- people that talked about this. That they were like, oh, it was too. It was too whitewashed. Like the first streamer awards, they were saying there was too many like white people. Um, however, that isn't like inherently a me problem. That is that is a platform problem, and I think every year it gets better. That more uh, like races are um, like pushed up to the top of Twitch and represented, and it's just because Twitch is expanding. Um, I think hopefully hate raids when it comes to race are getting sure. less and less and less. But that's like a lot of these don't problems are like me problems. They're systematic problems with like the platform. Here's don't you feel like a award for um, a white man then would be the most competitive of all of them? Yeah, it's basically <laughs> all the other ones. Thank that's- you. That's the thing is, if you go back and look at like the winners, it's not very like, it's mostly white men, which sucks. But but also, you know, that's what the platform is built on right now, Um, and I think uh, hopefully that changes over the next few years. Hopefully, it's way more diverse. But out of character, I don't know. Again, I think it's a noble award, and we both have your back. I'm scared. (laughs) It doesn't matter. People are gonna yell at you regardless. My point was trying to get you to have your back. Avoid that. Like, just don't listen. Yeah. Cutie, cutie, this is really serious. So cute. Cutie. What if I kissed her on the mouth? Would that be okay? <laughs> yeah, I don't care. Why are you asking me for? I'm this asking the, the anti bestiality people if that counts as bestiality. Anti bestiality. I don't want people to think I'm bestiality if I kiss her on the mouth. Oh my God, you're making this. So I walk Why are you saying that? Listen, 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 listen. Because I listen. kiss her on the mouth. Can I say something that you will listen to, please, as someone who gets yelled at all the fucking shit. time? You cannot, they're 1,000 million percent going to yell at you, yes. okay? From both the angle that it. Will presented <laughs> and the angle that I presented, uh-huh. they're going to say, why not this? Why not that? Okay? The, the real major problem here is you. Uh. It's your reaction to it. You cannot react to it. You just have to recognize that it's going to happen. And you don't have to like be right. You don't have to make an argument that like you are right and have people agree with you. Wow. It sometimes makes you Based. feel good. I know it makes everybody feel good to be like, oh, everybody listens to me. Everybody's like got my back. Yeah, but what if people stop watching my award show because they're mad? That's never going to happen. They might. No, that's insane. That is one million percent not going to happen. <sighs> Most of the people that are chirping at you on Twitter have literally never heard of your award. They were just geared to get mad about something that day because yeah. they're fucking losers and they're angry at themselves. Yeah. And they saw a bunch of other people yelling at you and they yeah. joined it on the phone. That's like 98% Guys, of fucking hate don't yell at me. Campaign. I'm asking nicely. Oh, they God. don't know that because they don't know you because they don't know the Guys, award show. Guys, if you see, hey, f- listeners of the podcast, if you see people yelling me on Twitter, send them this clip. Hello, sir, yelling at me on Twitter. Please stop. Yeah. Please. And you will have Hassan and my support from japan where we will be during the awards so. okay yeah if that's where you want to be that's where you want to be what can i do well i mean we'll do a nice call in 
Uh, I don't need it unless you win. <laughs> I'm winning shit, so yeah. Fine. Nominations start to Monday. I keep wanting to say tomorrow, but this could be I respectfully on asked Sunday. not to be nominated this year by Ooh. my community. You asked them not yes, to? Yes, because I don't want to just lose again. Archer <laughs> huh. probably do that too. Uh, I don't ask them to nominate me either. Yeah, I'm That's like, helpful. you know, save it for someone else that deserves it more yeah. or something. Someone who has a fight. You just chance. kicked the camera. I did? <laughs> yes. Oh my God. Wait, flip it? I, it's fine it? that you did. Oh, great. Good if job. you decide to do the uh -huh. fat nuts or thick ropes award, I will be there no matter what. I will be a nominee. I will be there and I'll work for it too. Uh, I'm not doing that. I will How work we get to, to not hour? nut for a long enough time so they can have the. We didn't get to talk the about the lady girl. who made out, but next week maybe. Well, let's talk about the lady who made out. We got a little time. You want time. to? Yeah, just quickly, five minutes. Hit me. Well, he's going to show a video. Was she like sloppy? I lost my job at my Christmas party last year. Story time. So my profession is an accountant, okay? So we all know what accountants are typically like. That was my workplace. Wait. So I actually became- Is she not actually an accountant? I just realized, because sometimes people say they're accountants, but they're sex workers. Oh my <laughs> God. Oh my God, this whole time I thought she got fired from her accountant job. I think she might have. Yeah, but no, is no, she actually just right. in sex work? Cutie's right. A lot of times, people on uh, TikTok on, on TikTok who are only oh my god. I think we are. I think you are both judging a woman by her jugs. Yeah. Didn't she just say I'm an account? Didn't she I just do accountant? Honest, I, That's how I, I lost my job at my Christmas party last year. Story time. So my profession is an accountant. Okay, so we no, all she know do air quotes. She just said you all know is what she said. What accountants are typically like. That was my work. Accountants are typically okay, like. Okay, this is confusing. Let's see the Okay, maybe she's an accountant. Place. I think she's just an so accountant. So I actually became an accountant literally I will as soon admit, as I left school. I did see the big jugs and I thought <laughs> those are impossibly large. I am with her. She is an accountant. Know, this woman is a victim. You know what it is? You know what it's like? They say accountant you know for what it's like? If sex you worker. see like if you see like a like a six foot five jack dude and you're and he tells you what he's doing and you're like oh you're wasting your talents you should be in he the nfl be yeah like all right let's just let's like okay. that's like i would be like oh you're built like a tight end like why are you doing accounting that's how i feel about this lady cool. straight into an apprenticeship and i have what just worked my way up in the corporate world okay. and obviously working your way up as a woman okay. is hard enough in general you know especially in the corporate world oh, now especially i'm sexist i didn't mean to and like finance i did originally IT, think she's like like accountant that. for the record. Them board meetings i'm the only girl there there there's no other girl it's like 50 year old men surrounded by me and i'm just there in my little like starbucks cup stanley cup and the setup of this company oh, was always just a stanley bit weird cup. to me not weird but weird so from the outside in it didn't look too strange ceo was a joint ceo it was a husband and a wife and the wife did a lot of kind of like the hr people part whereas the husband did he just worked with us managers and like he did a lot of the meetings he did a lot of the numbers anyway we have always had good christmas parties the ceo just always i'm gonna call him love to give him a name let's call him mark yeah. and then let's call his wife michelle so mark and michelle would always put on such good christmas parties everyone loved them it wasn't too big and I think that may have been the issue. There was maybe like 15 of us, including Mark and Michelle. So it really weren't like a huge company at all. We all got along. There wasn't like a huge turnover in people. People stayed and were there for like years and years. Oh so God, this current year, Mark and Michelle were having some issues. And as a company, she we did, did a great kind job of know this just because it was very apparent in like she their make behaviors. out with Mark? And I think the so. reason I mentioned I was part of the managers, it's a very male orientated and I'm the only girl, is because a lot of them married for one, but also make oh. a lot of just passes at me. And like, I'm so used now to like shoving it off and just being like, ugh, like whatever, they're just old creepy men. And Mark has always been one of them people as well, who has just always made comments. And like, I have always thought, wife's next door, you know? Like, let's not, let's not go there. So by the time the Christmas party came, we generally think Mark and Michelle are like filing for divorce. Like that's how serious we thought it got as a team. I feel like you can kind of see where this is going, but basically at the work Christmas party, I got very, ow, that was my eyelid. I got very drunk, okay? And I do some stuff I'm not, I just don't like what I do when I'm drunk. So there is <laughs> one guy who I work with and let's call him James. What? <gasps> 
There's more. There's more. There's more. Right? I promise. I worked hard for this. Okay. James. James isn't 50. James is 22. He is basically my age. And I think there's always just been that sort of tension between us. And at the work Christmas party, we ended up making out. And it wasn't in a private space. It was kind of directly at the dinner table. It weren't hidden. James actually went home quite early that night. He had stuff to do the next morning. However, I feel like the other men kind of thought this was a go ahead that I was about to start making out with all of them. And I did, I don't know why. And by everyone, I mean Mark oh. as well. Do you know what makes this worse? In front of Michelle. So that was actually our last working day. I had to live with about a week and a half of fear of going back to work. I received a meeting invitation and it was literally for the next day. And it was with both what did I call them? Mark and Michelle. I kind of knew straight away at that point that I was literally about to lose my job, and I did. Okay, so she's telling the story from her perspective. She RP'd relationship. <laughs> she's telling the story from her perspective, which makes uh -huh. me feel like, like there's probably more to the story than the way she's nope. explaining it. I think she was completely accurate, and I back that woman in every facet of her life. I... Don't think she Do she, you? she gets should she get yes. fired for that? <laughs> and I back her because she is a woman and I am sister solidarity. I don't think she should get fired for that. Uh, Maybe she should. Yeah, that's I, I don't agree. think she should. I agree. Yeah, you know what? I agree that she shouldn't get fired either. Could she? And we've uh, agreed on our first topic all night, and that's the end of this episode of Fear. That's right. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much. The calendars are on their way quickly. Thank you for supporting oh, yeah, us. I should have talked about A the calendars. Happy New Year to all of you, and we will be planning our Memphis trip soon. Thanks, everyone, and we'll see you next time. Watch the Patreon episode. There's a lot of bangers in there behind the paywall at patreon.com slash fear and we'll see you next time. Is is RPing relationships chill? See, that is making me think that you automatically think it's not. Yeah, I would kill yeah. myself. Why? If I'm upstairs making my boyfriend chili and I pull up his stream and he's asking some girl to be his girlfriend in pixel mode, yeah, I'm I'm ending it all. What a stupid fucking thing to do. But you're it's killing a, yourself? Cutie, yeah. Cutie, it's a character. It's that's not, not real. NMP, that's Jason. Guys, come on. You don't think? You, no. Am yeah, I? Yeah, I don't think so. I don't what? think it's that bad. I don't, I don't give a shit about Bro, it Bro, that is crazy. It is a... There's no way I'm alone here. It's a role... I, you are I alone. play a gay German man. That's offensive, you know that that's, one. You know that that's fantasy, right? I'm not a gay yes, German Yes, but you want to be a gay German well, man, so I'm that's why you do it. Well, I'm kind of a gay exactly. German man in my life. I mean... I, like, you think dude, you think I would? I want to be a seventy-year-old <laughs> yes <laughs> hairdresser from Dusseldorf. The more yeah. you talk about it, the more I feel like you are playing your future. <laughs>